any date you Madam, what is the case? Uh, sir, it's about my termination. You are working in which department? Judiciary. Okay. As a judge. Achha. Lord Shri will come to the last order which was passed. Lord Shri's query was very specific. What is the difference between... Ah, ji. this matter we have heard sometimes. Ji. You are not... See, please, please try to understand these things when you are on a probation. Yes, sir. What is your status? Please explain on this issue first. Yes. Sir. And what is the law which which provides that the probationer has to be protected in what manner? Yes. Sir. You you are you are taking the judgment that will not help you. Prime of I tell you. Yes. Sir. You are please go and search some judgment on probationer. Yes, sir. I have searched. Yes, please tell us now. Come to that judgment. Yes, directly to this judgment. Is now subsequently, uh, the Honorable Supreme Court has also taken some other view in 2019 or 18. You have you have gone through with the judgment of it is arising out of I think Rajasthan. Se hai shayad. You just check up it up. 22. Uh, yes, I think. I think uh, yeah, it's uh, Abhay Jain versus. Uh, yes. What do yeah. you say? What do uh, In this case, uh, the matter was also about this additional. He was uh, uh, an on a probation. Sorry. On a, he was on probation. Yeah, he was also in probation. Where well, you copy here? Yeah, yeah. Madam, don't tell. Yeah, yeah. Yes, please. Sorry, yes. sorry, sir. We are in living in Hindustan. So, sorry. Na? Doesn't sir. look nice. Sorry, sir. Sir, in this case, uh, Abhay Jain was uh, appointed as an additional district judge in mm -hmm. year of 2013, mm -hmm. and he was uh, while dealing with uh, some. Uh, bail matter hmm. he has uh, given bail hmm. and they, uh, that was the uh, uh, complaint against him hmm. he was in probation for two years into hmm. uh, and but uh, before uh, uh, and one anonymous complaint was filed against him stating that uh, after rejection of the high court on that uh, particular bail he granted the bail hmm. Mr. Appellate, uh, high court you tell us Yes, sir. What are the rules to record a finding whether the performance of the petitioner is satisfactory or not? Not sure. Whether any statutory rules have been framed? Not sure. Well, which says how the uh, performance appraisal has to be made? Sure. What is the pendency of the... Uh, what are the parameters laid down by the rules not made sure. in this? We have tell us on the next of it. Yes, sir. Yes. Final concluded confidential... Who are your, who are your uh, reporting authority? My reporting authority was the district judge. District judge. And uh, uh, reviewing authority is portfolio judge. And, honorable uh, portfolio. What is the role of the honorable the chief justice? Uh, sorry, my lord. Oh, whether the honorable chief justice is accepting authority? Yeah. Uh, sorry. Yes, sir. How? Whether, whether it has been defining the rules? I think schedule one is not attached with this rule. Yes. Schedule one is there. Sir. Yes, schedule one. Yes. Schedule Six. one. Uh, uh, seventh uh, serial yes. number seven. Yes. Judicial officers subordinate to ju district judges of concerned district. District judge is reporting authority. Portfolio judge of the concerned district is reviewing authority. And accepting authority is chief justice. Yes. Chief justice. Chief justice. What was the uh, whether the what was the comment of the uh, this review authority, whether he has agreed with the uh, uh, opinion given by the uh, reporting authority? Yes, sir. But the uh, ACRs is not a ground for you to not to continue in the service. They have not taken care. Uh, they have not taken into consideration the ACRs. While while uh, while not continuing uh, or while discontinuing your professional period. But my lord. Uh, so see this point will help you out. Please tell us. See, your services were terminated, discontinued, terminated, non professional period is not extended. When what was when the date of order was passed? 
when the order was uh, termination was passed 9th uh, uh, february 2017 2017 ACR was communicated to you on 1 4 2017. 10th April 2017. Tenth. Whether while not continue with you in service, they have taken into consideration the ACRs of you or not. Tell us. Yes, sir. Because it's. Where is the. Please read out the order of uh, termination. Please read out the order. Order of termination. Yes, please. Yes. Read out. Kindly see page number 49 of paper book. Yes, buddy. The government of Chhattisgarh, accepting the recommendation of the Honorable Court, Honorable High Court of Chhattisgarh, made in accordance with the sub rule 4 of rule 11 of the Chhattisgarh Lower Judicial Services Recruitment and Condition of Service Rules 2006 for termination of services of Kumari Akanksha Bhardwaj, member of Lower Judicial Service, presently posted as Civil Judge Class 2 Kankhir. Hereby terminates the service of Abo Manson Kumari Akanshabad with immediate effect. And what was the recommendation of the full court? There is no recommendation by the full court, my lord. No, no, it will be. There is only a standing committee who recommended my termination. What was the recommendation? Kindly see page number 409. Yes. Uh, para, uh, resolution second says the standing committee considered the overall performance and entire service record of Kumari Akanksha Bhardwaj on parousal of, uh, uh, parousal of the record. It is found that C is not fit for confirmation in service. Therefore, it is resolved to recommend termination of her service under sub rule 4 of rule 11 of the Chhattisgarh Lower Judicial Service Recruitment and Condition of Service Rule 2006. This recommendation was made by Standing Committee, my lord. Hmm. And it also says entire service record of Kumari Akansha Bhardaj. So, whether entire service record means your ACR has to be taken? See, ACR. And uh, this entire service record are uh, altogether different things. Means whether the this order doesn't speak about that uh, your ACRs have been taken into consideration. So I don't think that will help you out at the initial uh, at, at this at the moment. Once whether the performance assessed by the department by the standing committee is justified for termination or not, that has to be submit by the state, by the High Court. You are saying that you have taken two stand. One is that as per the judgment passed by the division bench of this court, the standing committee is not empowered to terminate. This is yes. your one, one yes. of argument on the last date of hearing? Yes, ma'am. The second is that the standing committee has, has considered the record and no opportunity of hearing has been given to you. This two of argument is there. Yes, ma'am. This is only two points you are want to emphasize. But uh, kindly see the ACR uh, communicated to me. In the year 2017 after termination. Yes, after sir. discontinuation of your probation period. Or yes, non, non extension of your probation period. The appropriate would be non extension of probation period. Or dismissal, termination, whatever the name is. But, but these two points mainly you are emphasizing that the standing committee has no power in view of the rule 4 of the rules of high court rules yes, the sir. standing committee cannot issue uh, cannot issue the, uh, the order for termination yes, sir. one is and the entire service record has been has been considered but no opportunity of hearing has been given to you uh, my lord one more thing is that yes. not entire service record was taken you are this you want to say sir the petitioner in uh, 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 in person would submit 